all of you. Um, my name is Jody Adams. I work with the research and development team where we manufacture the youth essence. And my job is to uh, source the materials that we use in the product. So I'm here to explain to you how we sourced a lot of the materials in the essence, what each one of them does to help you understand why it works so well. Let's see if my thing works here. Okay, so when we started sourcing, putting together this product, we set out to build a world-class product that really works and develop a world-class legendary brand. So in doing this, we set out to find, we have access to the newest raw materials that have been developed for skin care from all over the world. So we look at what we want to accomplish, and we source the raw material, but then we also, in doing that, we try to weed those out by looking at the manufacturing process. What are their quality controls? How do they, how do they guarantee that our raw material is going to be consistent? What kind of testing do they do on it? Do they use any harsh solvents or chemicals in developing it? So we look at all of this before we even choose what raw materials we're going, to, we're going to use. And then of course we look at whatever clinicals they have that will show us that it's been tested and found to be effective. So it's a lengthy process, just figuring out what we're gonna use. Then we look at what do we want to accomplish with it? So we look at what are the causes of skin aging? Well, we have behavior, stress, everybody's in a hurry and eats badly. Uh, we have environmental factors, pollutants, chemicals in, the, in our environments, and then we have our genetics, which there's only so much we can do about, but in general, what we set out to do is counteract these effects and make the skin function like young skin and that's how we want to that's what we set out to accomplish in developing this product so we look at what do we want to address well we got wrinkles we get dark spots and age spots we get some sagging sometimes we get broken capillaries sometimes we get redness um, cross-linking of intracellular collagen fibers so basically what we get is a breakdown of collagen and elastin, and that's what causes all of these different factors. So that's what we set out to address with the youth essence. Collagen is the main component of your skin. 72% of your skin is collagen. Uh, collagen, if you think of it as like the scaffolding of a building, it's the matrix that forms the barrier and the structure of your skin. There are actually collagen fibrins that are stronger than steel, gram for gram. Collagen is very, um, it, it's a very strong, it contains all the amino acids and all the proteins. And as we age, unfortunately, we have a decrease in collagen. So that's one of the things we wanted to address one of the primary things we set out to address with the youth essence. Am I too loud? No, no. Okay. no. Okay. So here's how the collagen decreases as we age. When we're babies, we have 80% collagen content in our skin. By the time we're in our 20s, we're down to 75%. 30s, we're already down to around 55%. And then when you get around my age, you're getting around... 30s to 40s percent of collagen. So this is really because this is what gives the smoothness and prevents the wrinkles. So this is really what we want to address. And you can see here, here's the, uh, the skin, here's the outer layer, and you got your collagen and elastin way down here. Out here is a natural moisturizing barrier. This is what helps to protect your skin. So we're addressing all the different layers here and I'm gonna show you as we go through the raw materials how we're gonna do that. <clears throat> so the key to skin care is to provide the nutrients and the water to the skin. If you think of your skin, if you think of a sponge, when a sponge is very dry, if you drip water on it, it just rolls off. Mm -hmm. 
and your skin is much the same way. So we, we look to keep the skin very well hydrated and when, you know, when, it, when a sponge is damp and you drip water on it, it will go all the way down into the sponge. That's what we're doing. So we're addressing the moisture so that our skin is prepared to bring the nutrients down in as far as we can. What nutrients are best for the skin? Smaller molecules that are absorbable to skin cells. Natural and safe, we don't want harsh chemicals. Really, we want to help our skin do what it already knows how to do. We don't want to use harsh chemicals that force it to do things. And we want it to be stable. <clears throat> okay, only collagen weighing 3,000 Daltons can be absorbed and used by the skin. A Dalton is a unit of molecular weight. So, um, Typical collagen is 15,000 to 50,000 Daltons. It's a quite a large molecular weight, not absorbable at all by skin. Um, but I do want to mention here, because there's a lot of skin care that contains collagen, and if, if you're hearing that you're going to increase the collagen in your skin by applying collagen, unfortunately that's not the way it works. It would be great if it did, but it doesn't. So. You're not going to apply topical collagen and increase the collagen content of your skin. However, why apply collagen? Collagen does a lot of great things when it is a smaller molecular weight. At 15 or 50,000, typical collagen Dalton weight is just going to sit on top of your skin and not do anything. Mm. So what we did was we sourced a marine plant-based collagen that is the 3,000 Dalton weight, and it is absorbable. And the value in this collagen is it has tremendous moisture retaining benefits. Mm -hmm. So we want it to, what we're doing with this collagen, and it also contains all the amino acids that are essential to your skin building blocks. And so this is going to absorb into that natural moisturizing layer, and it's going to really hold many times its weight in water and also enable the delivery of those amino acids. So we don't apply the collagen to build collagen, we apply the collagen to give the moisture and the amino acids and the nourishment that's going to help enable your body to retain the collagen it has and also produce more. So this is a breakdown of the ingredients that we're going to go through that we've sourced for the youth essence. So we've got agaricus bisporus, which is a mushroom extract, sodium hyaluronate, with some amazing peptides in this product that I'm, I'll explain to you how they function as we go through this. And then we have some great botanicals, Rustius aculatus, which is known as butcher's broom, and uh, Centella asiatica, Essen, and uh, calendula extract, and a hydrolyzed yeast pr protein. Every one of these ingredients has been individually sourced because each one has tremendous skin benefits. So I'm gonna explain those to you. So we're looking for five improvements here with the Youth Essence. We're gonna improve facial contours, effectively smooth wrinkles, maintain the skin and the moisture throughout the day, firm and plump skin, and we can also smooth and plump this chest area here. So don't forget when you do your skin care that this skin is this skin is just as fragile as your facial skin. So you don't want to neglect this area as well when you're doing your skin care. So we're affecting five repairs here. We want to brighten and repair skin, detoxify it, firm it, smooth it, resist inflammation, alleviate sensitivity and redness, resist oxidation, which contributes to aging. And also we want to reduce the dark circles around the eyes and firm that skin around the eyes. Okay, so I'm going to get into two of the very powerful peptides that are in this. Each one of these peptides is amazing on its own, but the combination of the two is what makes it particularly effective. So we've got the first one, which is called palmitoyl tripeptide one. This one has been shown to really smooth wrinkles on its own, far greater than if you've heard of um, vitamin A or, or retinol A, retin A, mm -hmm. 
this peptide actually has been found to be quite a bit more effective than that one in wrinkle reduction. The second peptide is called palmitoyl tetrapeptide 7. And this one has been shown to firm and improve some of the facial contours. But the amazing thing about the combination of these two peptides is how they inspire your skin and your body to produce more collagen. When your collagen in your skin breaks down, these, this combination of peptides is released. And that is what signals your brain to produce more collagen. So when we get this combination of peptides delivered into the skin, it has, it has been found in many independent studies, actually. It's very effective in what happens is you've got this combination of peptides that happens when your collagen breaks down that are telling your brain to make more collagen. Mm -hmm. That's how you get more collagen in your skin is mm -hmm. to, is for your body to, your body has to make it on its own if you're gonna get more. Mm -hmm. This combination of peptides has been the most effective way to um, spark your body, to make more of its own collagen and elastin. So that's why this combination of peptides is very, very powerful. One of the reasons that the youth essence works so well. The first botanical we're gonna talk about is Agaricus pisporus. This is a mushroom extract. This, is, uh, this particular one is sourced in Russia. This is a very powerful um, extract. It produces an immediate tightening effect. So I, I don't know if you if you, you heard Belinda last night talking about spraying it on half of her skin and noticing a, almost like she had a facelift on one side. This extract has a lot to do with that. Mm -hmm. It'll give you an immediate tightening sensation. It also helps to reduce pores, so you get a lot of improvement in the appearance of your pore size. And also helps to control oil. So um, a lot of people find that if they have acne or mm -hmm. um, skin conditions, that they find that they, they get a lot of improvement in those skin conditions, mm -hmm. largely because of this extract. This extract has been used for years and years as an astringent. But the other great thing about it, and another one of the reasons we chose it, is because it also contains polysaccharides. And what that means is it delivers moisture. So many natural astringents like witch hazel or some of those that you see, they have a drying effect. This one has all these astringent properties, but also moisturizing. There's no drying effect with this one. Uh, we also have hyaluronic acid. You're all probably familiar with this. This has been in skincare for a long time. The reason is because it holds a thousand times its weight in water. So when it's combined with that marine collagen at the 3,000 Daltons, you've got a lot of moisture being held in that moisturizing layer. So it gives you a lot of protection and a lot of moisture that will stay all day. Very effective. Okay, the next one, this is another amazing peptide. I'm gonna talk a little bit more about how this peptide works in a little bit. But in addition to the wrinkle reducing effects we'll talk about later, this peptide has also been shown to smooth and plump this area around your chest here. So that's an additional benefit that people have been finding with this peptide. Okay, hydrolyzed yeast protein. Uh, we actually sourced a, a very, very powerful hydrolyzed yeast protein. And a lot of people are familiar with yeast and fermentation and how it's very healthy for you, how fermenting makes things very bioavailable with your wine and your bread and all of that. Well, on your skin, it has similar benefits. Yeast actually has a very similar cell structure to human cells, and, and that's why it's very compatible. And yeast is packed full of amino acids and vitamins and minerals that are particularly good for your skin. So this particular yeast extract is developed from a fermentation of a variety of botanicals. And what's produced during that fermentation is <coughs> a, additional polysaccharides and also nanotized collagen. This collagen is more like a thousand Dalton weight. So that combination of the polysaccharides and the nanotized collagen actually enables 